This video is sponsored by Soul Premise. Soul Premise has amazing bags for sneakerheads. Their bags are great quality, very nice, highly used leather. I love the smell, it smells so good, and the quality of material is awesome. Let me show you guys how awesome Soul Premise bags really are. So this right here is the big bag that you wanna take away with you for a few day travel. Let me show you guys how many compartments this one backpack has. It's crazy, and it's perfect for sneakerheads. So right here we have the big compartment. You could put a bunch of sneakers in this compartment. I just took my shoes out of this bag. That's why it's open, but tons and tons of space. Then you have another compartment here in the middle for your laptop. I just took my laptop out so I can edit. And then you have another compartment with more sneakers. I have my Mocha Ones just chilling in there right now. And take a look at the front, guys. You have two really nice compartments there in the front, two nice zipper compartments. And my favorite part about this bag has to be the bottom. Let me show you guys this bottom. I have my Fire Red Force at the bottom as well. Awesome. Awesome for sneakerheads. Make sure you guys check out Soul Premise. I'm going to leave my link down below in the description. My discount code, Danny Moore. My name, Danny Moore, together will save you 40% off of your purchase. So make sure you guys check out Soul Premise down below. I finally got some exclusive access from Nike. I'm excited, man. This is a sneaker I was really looking forward to. I think a lot of you guys are really looking forward to this sneaker too. There's going to be some hype. This sneaker sold out on the exclusive access. There will be more drops of this sneaker. Tons of restocks coming. So if you didn't get the exclusive access, don't worry. They're going to release a ton more pairs. A lot more restocks coming. I'm very excited, man. I got finally got some exclusive access. I want to tell you guys one little tip on how I think you can actually increase your chances of copying and getting some exclusive access. Create a new account, man. If you've been taking L after L and just never getting exclusive access and it's been, I would say, more than six months, create a new account. Just try it. Create a brand new account, brand new phone number, brand new everything, and just try. Try, try, try that way. A lot of people are getting banned and shadow banned, they call it, from the sneakers app and Nike and not even knowing it. That's what's crazy, man. You don't even know. You know, you just have no chance and you don't even know. So like I said, if you've been taking L after L, try creating a brand new account. Let's get into this unboxing from Nike. And I'm kind of shocked right here that this is actually from Nike. You guys notice what I'm noticing? Yeah, where's the Just Do It tape? We got no Just Do It tape on this box. And this is a box I've never received from Nike before. Not that I'm aware of anyway. This is cool. I like this box. I'm not sure if this is just a box that they use without the sneakers app because this exclusive access was not on the Nike sneakers app. This exclusive access was on the Nike app. Make sure you guys have both. Trust me. Let's get straight into this unboxing. This is a sneaker I'm very excited to see. This box, I'm going to open it, I guess, this way. Don't even need a knife for this one. All right. Let's get these out. I'm excited, man. This is a dope shoe. I think these are really fire. I want you guys to stay tuned to the channel because I did order some paint to do a custom. Gotta change these. I have to do it. I absolutely need to do it. You guys will see. Make sure you guys stay tuned for that video. Hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications to be notified when I do post some sneaker content, which is almost every day. So make sure you guys click that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. Right here, we do have my size. 11 right here. This, so this is going to be a personal pair. I'm excited. Retail is only 115 Awesome retail price point. Let's see. Let's see. Woohoo! Even better in hand. The Jordan 1 Mid Bread or Band. Whatever you guys want to call it. These are fire. Straight fire. I'm excited for this one. This is a dope shoe. And now having them in hand, let me take a look at both. Because I'm noticing something compared to normal Jordan 1 mids. Let me take a look. Let's get the box out of here. Let's take a look at these a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm with this, man. This is dope. I wish every Jordan 1 mid was like this, to be honest. And what I'm talking about right now is the leather quality. It's nothing crazy. Don't get me wrong. Nothing crazy. But it's a lot better than most Jordan 1 mids. They give us nice texture to it. It does have some wrinkles going on. The Wings logo is dope. Look at that leather. Very, very soft to the touch. Very nice, man. They give us some decent quality. It's a little stiff, but not like normal Jordan 1 mids. These are dope. These are really fire, to be honest. Now, there is one thing I know a lot of you guys are going to say, 
and what in the world is the red doing there on the eyelets? Don't worry, make sure you guys stay tuned. I'm gonna be customizing that. I have to, I gotta make it black. I have no choice. I have to, man. I absolutely need to. You can see the red on the eyelet. That's the only difference. I do have uh, actually two pairs of red ones. Let me pull them out. So I got a few pairs of bread or band Jordan ones here. Let's go through them. So this is the mid. Right here I have the 2013 pair, which I wore the crap out of like crazy. This right here is the 2013 bread one. And I stole a dead stock pair of 2016 band ones as well never wore them never tried them on anything like that never even laced them up still dead stock when they released so i have all three right here let me know man these are close these are close so, so let me give you guys a little comparison obviously the only real main difference is that little red on the eyelets it should, should be black just like this or just like the 2013 retro as well we know nike and jordan brand they're not going to give us what we truly want with these mids but it's very close. It's honestly the next best thing. This right here is definitely, in my opinion, the best Jordan 1 mid ever. Hands down, by far. These, the Chicago White Heel, which I also have in my collection, and the Black Toe Chicago's, those are dope as well. A few other Jordan 1 mids scattered throughout releases, but this by far, in my opinion, the best. The best one, man. These are really dope. I am excited to do that custom to make it black. I need to, uh, but they're really dope, man. The drop man on the tongue, it is what it is. You do have the red bottom, the white midsole. Everything's the same. It is the bread colorway after all, which is just one of my favorite colorways of all time on any sneaker. So, man, I'm hype. Got some exclusive access and I'm excited to do this custom. Make sure you guys stay tuned. Let me know if you guys want me to do maybe a full review on feet video of these as well. Drop that comment down below, let me know. But man, I had to show you guys these, this quick unboxing. So clean and so fire. I love, love this colorway. And they did a good job with the mids. Fire, straight, fire. Let me know down below in the comments, did you guys get exclusive access to this Jordan 1 mid? Let me know if these are a cop. Are they a drop? Like I said, they will be restocking a lot of pairs. I do expect them to sell out. The hype will build for these, like they did for the other mids. So I do expect them to sell out pretty much every time. Resell eventually will go up in price. These are clean. I'm excited to throw these on feet and rock these like crazy. I didn't wear my 2016 pair, and now I really don't need to wear the 2016 pair for quite a while. So, ah, I'm happy, man. I'm really happy. These are straight fire. I want to remind you guys to enter in the Royal Toe Jordan 1 giveaway that does end in just a few days over on my Instagram. So make sure you guys check out that Instagram post. Subscribe, hit that thumbs up, leave a comment down below. Follow me on Instagram, you'll see the giveaway post. Subscribe here on YouTube to Affordable Shoe Review. Give him a follow on Instagram. And once again, on that giveaway post on my Instagram, you'll see me holding the Royal Toes. Just like the post, tag two friends, and you are entered. The giveaway does end in just a few days. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys join the More family. Hit that subscribe button, smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop always dropping that fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching.